talking to Duro, I guess, you know, how's it, how's it been signing contract with the club? Yeah, I'm really excited. Um, obviously, I was on trial here for a period of time, and now um, signing a contract was... Um, yeah, I'm over the moon about that, and I can't wait to get started on New Year's Eve against um, the Jets in front of our home fans. Obviously, you came over here on a trial and set out to get that contract, yeah. I guess, but where was it? what was it that made you go, yep, no, I want to I I stay here? Well, I think uh, I really believe in what the, the, the coach is doing. Um, from the first game I played, I felt really comfortable in the system. Uh, the players have been nothing but accommodating to me. A uh, really good bunch of boys, good culture. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's, they're the main reasons. And how are you feeling, obviously, coming up to the season start? Yeah, I'm really excited. It, it's going to be really good to play in front of fans again. Uh, can't wait for that. And, yeah, we're, we're really excited for the start of the year. And obviously against the Jets, that's yeah. That's a, that's a big one. Yeah, it's a derby. Yeah, yeah, it's a it's a derby. It's a it's a it's a perfect way to start the season, it's, especially at home. So I'm sure there'll be a great turnout, and we, yeah, we can't wait for that one. And so talk me through, I guess, you know, what do you think you're going to be up? What's your goal? What do you what do you look to bring to the side? This year? Um, although I'm still quite young, I've got um, a fair bit of A League experience. Uh, I've won a title with with Melbourne Victory, which is obviously everyone's everyone's goal uh, to win it to win it A League Championship. So I bring that level of experience. Uh, you know, play can play on the right or left side. Um, so yeah, I will bring some experience, which that's that's probably the main thing. And obviously, that championship victory was against the Jets. As well. Yeah, it was. It was. Yeah, that was. It's obviously uh, in the past now. It's you know it's, a, it's something I'm very fond of, but I'm fully focused on you know my new role at, at the Mariners, and I can't wait to get started. And what is it? Um, how, how are you feeling with squads coming together? Yeah, good. We've got a mix of uh, young boys, experienced boys, which is obviously great. I think um, in training the, the level, of the standards high. Um, so yeah, I think we're in a really good position. So talk me through just a bit of background. Obviously, you know you played, played a lot of A League, A League games. But sort of where started, you started in Ballarat. Yeah, started in Ballarat. I um, moved to Melbourne. Um, if you're twelve, I played uh, in the Victor Youth team for a number of years, and then worked my way up into the first team. Um, spent a bit of time in Brisbane, and and ended up here um, after you know uh, a trial, which I couldn't wait to get here. I had to do two weeks quarantine in Darwin, which was Obviously, just part of the process, but um, I wouldn't change anything, and I'm, I'm really happy to be here. How was that process? Obviously, that's not something you would have to do on a No, yeah, season. exactly. It was something that I guess this year's been difficult for everyone, a lot of adversity, but um, I just did what I had to do. Two weeks, I could, you know, do do the exercise I needed to do up there. Um, you know, it was hot, but it was it's worth it because, um, you know, I'm here today, and I've signed my contract, and, I, yeah, as I said, I can't wait for the, for the first game of the season. Obviously, near to the coast, I guess. You yeah. Know, what would be something that you'd say, you know, to people that you know they might not know that obviously you're a football player? But what, what, what are you doing in your spare time? Well, at the moment, I'm in the process of obviously settling in. I, I'm new to the area, but I've tried as much as I can to explore around. It's it's a beautiful part of Australia. We've played here. A few, I've played here a few times, and staying in, in Terrigal, right? You know, across from the beach, like it. The lifestyle is really, really good here, and, and everyone, all the people I've met, have been really nice. So, um, I'm loving my time here. Um, any other, any other hobbies or anything that's good? Not, not at the moment. No, no, nothing different. No, yeah. pretty, pretty stock standard hobbies. And obviously, you've got a, tr- um, pre-season trial coming up. Yeah. Just talk me through that. How are you feeling yeah. about that? Yeah, against Arpia. Yeah, that's another good hit out. Um, as many games as possible before the season starts is ideal. Um, and obviously, we're you know, three weeks away now, so every every game counts, and um, you know the boys are going to take that one, you know, s- s- very seriously and, and get the most out of it. Yeah, that was you know I was I used the I played at Green Gully. I you know got so much respect for that club. They gave me the platform um, to to get back. Although the season was cut short due to COVID, um, you know, the work I put in away from the field, I knew would, um, you know, put me in good stead for when I come up here. And yeah, the, I was um, as determined as ever to, to get, you know, to do well. And I, you know, backed myself, believed in myself and um, the rest is history. Now I'm here and, and that's, you know, I'm really, really excited.